I have been placed, in a way, with a photograph that I believe came from my mother's Homer storage. And I saw it along my path, and I question, is a elder brother playing with my mom's property, or are they failing to tell me something's happened? The life of an American citizen involves a lot of things, but the visuals of a parent's home is something that stays with us and doesn't play with us. When I choose my own property for my own home, it has my feeling, my faith, my spirituality in it. But someone broke a cross of mine that was to represent my love of my life and how she makes me feel in life. Now she lights up like the sun when she talks and when she does her thing by my life. In life, we have most of the time to speak the truth about life and the truth of life is about love, life, and liberty and legacy. Legacy is the thing we leave behind us. What will your legacy be today? How will you show the world who you were in every way? If you're a famous star, then you already have that by far. But if you're a simple person like me, what you leave behind is the impact that we have on the people who around us. Not the people who guide us, because God is my guide, and I don't need to have a human try to be that for me. I get plenty of advice, plenty of opportunities to listen to the Lord's house because I have been selected, I have been chosen, just like you, but more for me, to be what I am today. It wasn't who I was when I was in my 30s, it wasn't who I was when I was in my 20s, it wasn't even who I was when I was in my teens, but I always had the spirit of evangelism in me. It's something that my parents promoted in their lifelong legacy.